interesting choice of music, I think. <laughs> when it comes to fighting a cold or flu, we'll all try anything to feel good. That includes home remedies like chicken soup or honey with lemon. But do they really work? This morning on Health Watch, registered dietitian Samantha Heller will separate fact from fiction with an early show true or false quiz. Samantha is the author of Get Smart, Samantha Heller's Nutrition Prescription. Great to have you with us, Samantha. Thank you. Nice to, see you. Nice, nice to be here. And the quiz. So are you guys wow. feeling well? Are you healthy this winter? Are you hanging in there? Yeah, better, we've better. been through it, yeah, but we're, had, like, we're moving. Thing going on. Have yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we have some, we have some uh, a quiz for you, and you will learn something to help soothe those throats. Okay. So true or false? When you have honey and lemon, it reduces symptoms of cold and flu. False. I'm going to say true because it makes you feel better. She wins this one, oh. and she wins the car we have out there. <laughs> yeah, right. You're okay. fantastic. Well, honey actually does soothe your throat. Lemon is high in vitamin C, which, which is good for you, but it also seems to cut the mucus. And the other thing about honey, which most people don't realize, is that it's a very effective topical wound healer. Hmm. So when you put it on a wound, and of course you want to go through your doctor with this, it actually creates hydrogen peroxide and decreases bacteria for tough healing wounds. So it's actually a very thoughtful healing substance. Okay. Is there a certain amount that we should be striving for? For, or is it kind of like just do as you will? I think a teaspoon and a cup of tea with some, you know, with some lemon tastes good and it does soothe your throat. Right. So okay. I think it's actually okay. a great idea. What's next? True or false? Drinking orange juice reduces cold symptoms. False. Yeah, I'll say false too. You guys are doing really well. It is false. You know, you I just, just followed what he said, to yeah, be honest, right, right. in that one. You see the ads of the guys with the gallon things of orange juice. Actually, vitamin C does not have the healing properties that Linus Pauling said it did back mm. in the 70s. It doesn't reduce cold symptoms by 45%. Maybe in extreme cold or ex for extreme athletes, a little vitamin C might help. But what we All do right. know is that it's so abundant in fruits and vegetables, you really don't have to mega dose with it. And when you're eating those healthy foods regularly, you will be less likely to get sick. Okay. So that's a good one. Okay. Goodness. Next one, true or false? Feed a cold, starve a fever. Ooh, that's a tough one. False. True. And, and it could go, everyone, is it feed a cold or starve a cold? <laughs> Nobody knows which way, but either way, it's false. Ah. Uh. Because if you so starve, she, so she bang, 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 bang. <laughs> yes, she won that one. Right, if you right. starve either a cold or fever, then you're not giving your body the energy it needs to fight off those infections. Mm -hmm. And your body needs those energies. It needs hydration to help fight infection as well. So you don't want to starve yourself. You also don't want to overeat. You don't want to feed it a lot by eating a lot of junky or bad food, which will increase internal inflammation and also lower your resistance. So eating the healthy foods is what will help you get through those times if not feeling so well. Okay, one more. All right, chicken soup, true or false? Chicken soup is good for the soul. True. True. It probably is good for your soul, but it's actually a small study said that the neutrophils, which are inflammatory agents, it decreases the migration of those to those areas. The heat from the broth helps uh, moisturize your face. Your nose is silly. It helps reduce uh, the, the bacteria. It's a moisturizer, too. It, it, it does So it it's really good for you, but add a lot of vegetables, okay. too. Humidifiers. humidifiers. Oh, humidifiers, true or false? Does it help relieve symptoms of cold and flu? True. Yes, true. Upper respiratory infections, uh, infections absolutely yes. Right. The good news is it does soothe it. It moisturizes these nasal passages that helps you fight infection. The bad news is if you don't clean it regularly, you'll be spewing goo and fungus out. So you uh, have to clean nice. them regularly, and Gross. you will be feeling better and healthier Chicken as well. Chicken soup and the humidifier. Wow. Yeah, because that's moist, right. Moisturizer. Yeah. Thanks, Good Samantha. to see you, Samantha. You too. And uh, for more tips on what works and what doesn't work for various ailments, you can head to our partner in health, webmd.com, and search home remedies.